I'm sure by now you've heard of MCT oil before and the benefits. Increased fat burning, better appetite control, increased energy. It almost sounds too good to be true, but is it? In today's video, we're gonna be talking about what is hype and what's real and the benefits you'll experience if you drink MCT oil every day. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Kate. I'm a certified health and nutrition coach. I post videos here on YouTube twice a week talking all things insulin resistance, weight loss, sleep, and more. So if you're ready to take control of your metabolic health, make sure to click that subscribe button. And you can also find me on TikTok and Instagram where I share new posts every single day. Before we get into it, let me know in the comment section down below if you've used MCT oil before and the benefits you experienced because I'm curious to hear how well it worked for you. We're gonna start off by breaking down exactly what MCT oil is, then we will get into the benefits you'll experience if you drink it every day, and we'll finish off by talking about how you can add it in to your diet. MCT stands for medium chain triglycerides, and these are a type of saturated fat. As the name suggests, they're made of medium length chains of fat. This is in contrast to most of the fat we consume which is long chain triglycerides. LCTs make up the majority of fat in olive oil, eggs, and butter, for example. Now what makes MCTs different is because they are shorter, they are more easily digested. They do not require other enzymes for digestion and they bypass our digestive tract entirely, going straight to our liver where they are turned into ketones. Because of this, they can be used for energy faster than other types of fat. MCTs are found naturally in foods such as coconut and dairy products. MCT oil is made when MCTs are isolated and made into a supplement. Usually MCT oils are made from coconut oil or palm oil. Now before we get into the benefits, I just quickly want to mention that there are a few different types of MCTs and not all of them are as beneficial as the other ones. C8 and C10 are the most beneficial ones and these are the ones you want to look out for when you're buying an MCT oil. These numbers represent the number of carbons and the lower the number, the easier it's gonna be for your body to digest it. If you see an MCT oil that is mainly C12, it's probably not worth buying because C12 has more carbons. It's more difficult for your body to digest. It basically just gets digested like any other fatty acid. So it kind of defeats the purpose, but unfortunately a lot of cheaper brands on the market, they will use C12 as a filler <laughs> to make the product less expensive. So C8, C10, those are the ones you wanna look out for. But anyways, now let's get into the benefits you'll experience every day if you drink MCT oil. Number one, increased fat loss. Now there's a couple different reasons why MCT oil can support and boost fat loss. First off, as we already discussed, it's a quick energy source. By consuming MCT oil, you can reduce the amount of spikes and crashes in your energy. Your energy is going to be more stable instead, so you're gonna have fewer cravings. One 2017 randomized control trial found that when participants included two tablespoons of MCT oil with breakfast, they ended up eating less at lunch. But the second reason is that because of how MCTs are digested, they bypass the fat storage pathway and they go straight to the liver where they're turned into ketones. Basically that means that they can't be stored as fat and when you combine that with the fact that they promote fat burning, it's a win-win. Number two, increased energy. As we've already discussed multiple times, because of how quickly MCTs are digested, they can promote a quick boost in energy. They are processed rapidly and turned into ketones. And this is why a lot of people like to consume MCT oil in the morning. Number three, increased brain function. Ketones can pass through the blood brain barrier and they are a cleaner energy source for the brain. A lot of people report feeling more focused and less distracted when they consume MCT oil. And this isn't just a placebo. Number four, increased athletic performance. MCTs are thought to help to reduce lactic buildup which can hinder athletic performance. 
A study done on cyclists found that those who took 1.5 teaspoons of MCT oil with food before cycling had lower lactic levels and found it easier to exercise than those who took long chain triglycerides. I pretty much take MCT oil before every workout. When I remember if I'm working out in the morning, I just add it to my coffee and I find it gives me enough energy to push through. So if you feel like you need something before a workout, especially in the morning, but you don't wanna have a big meal, which I don't really suggest anyways, MCT oil is a great option. Okay, so by now you're probably thinking that all sounds great, but how do you consume it? And I did just mention putting it in coffee, but we'll get back to that in a second. Before we go any further, I just wanna say that the first time or the first couple times you consume MCT oil, if your body's not used to consuming it, then you might experience some digestive distress, especially if you consume it on an empty stomach. So it's best to start with a smaller dose, maybe a teaspoon and work your way up to one or two tablespoons. That's really the maximum you need. <laughs> and I also wanna say that there are two ways you can buy MCT oil. You can buy it as a liquid or as a powder. And I'm gonna link to some of my favorite brands in the description box down below. Now, traditionally, MCT oil comes as a liquid, but I think the powder is really great because it causes a lot less digestive distress for people who are just starting out. And it's also a little bit easier to mix into drinks and food. Sometimes when you put the oil directly in a liquid, it kind of pools to the top and then you just get a mouthful of the oil, which I mean, honestly, it has a very neutral taste. It doesn't really taste like anything. Probably the easiest way to consume MCT oil is to take it right off the spoon. <laughs> it just tastes oily, which isn't terrible, but yeah, the taste is very neutral. But if you'd rather mix it into something, another really popular option is Bulletproof Coffee. Bulletproof Coffee is coffee that is blended with healthy fats, so usually it always contains MCT oil and butter and its purpose is to boost energy, ketone production, and to help you extend your fat fasting window. You can also use MCT oil in salad dressings. As I said, it's very neutral, so it's easy to just add to a dressing that you're making with maybe some vinegar, some lemon, whatever else. You won't even taste it. Or you can always add the liquid or the powder to a smoothie. This is also gonna make your smoothie more blood sugar and insulin friendly or even just mix it straight into water. Anyways guys, that's all I have for you today. So let me know in the comment section down below if you currently use MCT oil and any of the benefits you experience. I love chatting with you guys down there, so please leave a comment. And again, I'm gonna link some of my favorite brands of both MCT oil in liquid form and powder form. If you guys did enjoy this video, you might also enjoy my video on signs that you're iodine deficient, which a lot of people do not realize they are. You can check it out here. If you wanna catch up on my most recent upload, you can find it here. And if you wanna check out my coaching programs, including my seven day insulin resistance masterclass, you can find that here. Thanks guys, I'll see you next time. Bye.